Hey y'all, welcome into the channel. I hope you guys are having a good evening. Y'all was sitting here meditating. The spirit just showed me something. Y'all, there's been a scientific um procedure or experiment, like something like that. Okay, but it's gone terribly wrong. Okay, um, it has something to do with our ancestors, you guys. Okay, um. The vision that I got, it was like, yeah, see something, right? Okay, we got the chariot and the star heart, okay? Um, the vision that I received was that, like, they were trying to do something with our ancestors' body, underground, somewhere, something revolving around Florida, something's going on in Florida, okay? Um, Milwaukee. I'm here in Kansas. Y'all, something's going on. Anyway, um, in the vision, it was like they had this this person under some sort of surveillance. They had them attached to some sort of machines in some sort of laboratory, and it's like things just went wrong. Like this person, I don't know what they were doing. I don't know if this is someone waking up in the middle of surgery. Like they're not sleep. Like I don't know. It's something like that. Like someone's having some sort of experience in some sort of hospital or laboratory. Okay. Somewhere. And it's like something went wrong. Okay. I don't know what this is, y'all. Um, let's get into it. All things are the greatest, highest white light. Most high, holy angels. Holy ancestors, show me clearly, Spirit. What's going on? What is this? What is this vision? It was like almost like someone was trying to control the strings. And here it is. Nine wands. This is a shipwreck, y'all. Something has gone wrong. I don't know. I'm trying to show this without the light. Um, Something's gone wrong. Okay, this was done in the dark as well. Whatever this is, it was done in the dark. They were testing, they were doing some sort of testing. They were testing because I'm hearing they were. They were doing something. I'm hearing lab rat. They were testing. They were doing something and something's gone wrong. I'm telling you that right now. Whatever this is, whatever they were trying to control, it broke free. <laughs> we have the moon here. Yeah, it's broken free. Something spread its wings like something's not bound. Like it's... They thought, somebody thought they had something or someone under some sort of control. They thought that they were the doctors. They thought that they were the scientists. They thought that they were the professionals. But it's like something's gone on. wrong. Six of Cups, the horn with the confirmation. Six of Cups. Something went wrong. Y'all see that big X right there? Yeah. And then it, it's that. Let me look at this card. Let me see. Yeah, someone's more powerful than they. Something or someone that someone was trying to manipulate or control is way more powerful than they thought. For a disc. And that fell on top of that nine of wands. It's like. It's, it's kind of giving me the energy of. The playing field being leveled. Whatever is about to happen, it's about to trigger some major healing. Although it may not, it's not going to show up like that. It's going to show up like 
I'm hearing like a catastrophe. <sighs> Three of Wands. But it's like know that whatever this is, it's already been overcome. The op it's already, it's like the obstacle is behind you. So it's like you're receiving news of this. But there's also already, also already a solution in place or something like that. Eight cups. Okay, so it's like you're receiving news of this. Like they're going to, this is possible like something they're going to release on the news, right? Or you're going to receive some sort of communication about this. But this is something that has already transpired. But now they're going to, they're going to backtrack Eight of Cups and they're going to tell you, I feel like what, what the truth was, what was, what the, you're going to find out what was really, you're going to, somebody about to find out what was really going on. Yeah. Okay. Now we got that Four of Swords energy. Where did I pick up the Four of Swords? I don't know. Anyway, Four of Swords, Six of Disc, The Star, Justice, Page of Wands, Ten Wands, Nine of Cups, The Sun, and The Lovers. Y'all, that is so many damn cards. But let me just look at it. Let me see what Spirit is saying. It's like, okay, so they're going to run it back. And then it's like, because whatever this is, it done went wrong already. It's already happened. The obstacles are already, the obstacle, Mercury retrograde will tell your speech up, okay? Your word dictionary that you usually can pull from, you know, the word in your mind. No, they not, they don't. In Mercury retrograde, look, <laughs> in Mercury retrograde, they don't exist. It's gone. Okay, so anyway, um... Yeah, whatever they, they done did, okay, whatever has transpired, it went wrong. It already went wrong, okay? But it's like now with this Eight of Cups, know that you're finding out about, it's like you're finding out after, you're, this is the aftermath. This is already transpired. You're finding out after the fact, whatever this is, okay? And now there's going to be healing, okay? Four Swords. Six of Disc. So that Four of Swords is falling under the moon. So I was saying how this is not going to show up. It's going to show up like something, but it's really something else. It's for your benefit some way. Like some type of way this is for your good okay with the star card here all right and justice it's like yeah i just get the energy like whatever this was or whatever this is when they release it, the news of it they're also going to give you the solution so because they ain't going to tell you about this until they they got a way to fix it so to fix it right so it's like somebody here has a way to fix something but they ain't gonna tell you about the they ain't gonna tell you about the it's like they're not gonna tell you that some stuff was messed up until they know how to fix it so behind the scenes somebody done fucked up <laughs> that's what I'm saying somebody done effed up behind the scenes y'all Spirit could have kept this hidden from you. Like, even though, like, most of you guys are empaths, so you guys know and kind of pick up on little things anyway. So it's like you probably picked up on something. This is whether you're a reader or not, right? So it's like you picked up on something. But Spirit didn't reveal it to you because Spirit was already working it out on the back end. It wasn't for you to, to handle because Spirit was already taking care of it, right? So it's like when you find out what happened, it's going to be like, 
oh my god what and then it's gonna be like but chill chill says chill bro because it's already you know what i mean we'll do here's what here's the now here's the ramif the ramifications is that the word spirit ramifications but it's like here's the penalties here's what here's what transpired here's what ensued because this transpired okay it's like that okay so yeah with the page of wands like the obstacle was was tore up they tore tearing up the chicken right they're tearing the obstacle apart okay and then we got the ten of wands so that's confirmation endings ten of wands endings to a heavy burden okay they was watching behind the scenes somebody was watching you behind the scenes it's like your ancestors were watching you your spirit guides were watching you they had your back the whole time Okay, so that's how they were able to come in and take care of the business without you even basically being disturbed in so many ways because you're sitting over here in this nine of cups energy. The sun is shining in your life. You're happy. You're enjoying your own company. You're in love with self. You're working on future investments. You're thinking futuristically. You're taking notes, journaling, and uh, manifesting, investing, stuff like that in your own happiness, right? So you're like over here in your own world okay um the world of just being in love i feel like with yourself in love with the most high the enlightenment that the most high provides in that type of a partnership like the benefits you're you're basking in in the benefits of being a child of the most high so you're quite unfazed but this is how unfazed you really 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 were or are like justice the star like spirit came through the sun gemini but well, that's not just gemini that's the lovers so the sun the lovers nine of cups justice six of pentacles six of cups four of swords the sun like all of that is like spirit saying don't worry we handle that shit look king of wands i'm telling you king of swords not a swords. who is this knight not a swords don't worry we handled it do you know what i'm saying there's no there was no need for you to be informed about anything really because we handled it on the back end yeah, ancestors and spirit God, look at this confirmation. So whatever was going on, what is this? You know the death card. Whatever was going on, it's like your ancestors with the temperance, Archangel Michael, they took care of it. The magician energy, they got their hands dirty for you, right? This is a benefit of walking in the light. This is a benefit of walking in this type of a partnership right here. I'm telling you, thank you, Spirit, for covering and protection. Because even though darkness may be going on all around you, because you walk in the light, you've done the inner child healing work, you're moving from an enlightened space, a healed space. That means what's mirroring back to you is just that, justice. Look at that sign. Y'all see that sign on the justice card? This is what's mirroring back. Justice. The same ray of sunshine that she's looking at over here. It's justice. It's the sun that the lovers is encompassed in. All that yellow energy. Ocean energy. Shout out to the Orisha right this is like justice your ancestors this is what they're saying we handled it for you we didn't need to inform you there was no need for your peace to be disturbed no wonder you see all this stuff because y'all i've been i'm sorry and i'm not i'm just gonna speak my truth here but all this stuff that's been going on y'all i've been seeing it and i'll be like lord keep you know keep keep everybody safe and stuff like that but in the same breath i also know that you know spirit is intentional and everything happens for a reason nothing is by chance nothing is by mistake nothing is by accident 
even though things can appear, show up one way, nothing's by accident. So what I'm seeing here is that, yeah, you walk in the light, spirit will fight your battles for you. You don't, there's nothing for you to, what do you, all you need to do is focus on service. Focus on walking in the light. Focus on the light. Look at this. Trust. Focus. Look how focused they are on the light. Look at her, they. Just her. Her and her crystals. Look how focused she is on the light. That's what I'm saying. And behind the scenes, like the world could be going to shit. But it's like, you're okay. There's no need for you to worry. Focus on this light. This light is the justice. Focus on the light. And know that everything else, as long as you are continuing to remain in this partnership, Gemini energy, in this lover's energy, with the light, it's like you're good. You're protected. You'll be provided for. You can celebrate. Your spirit will be light, even in the darkness. Because even in that, you guys, like, you know, my condolences to anybody who's lost anyone. But what I'm saying is, like, it's an energy of, you got to know, like, there's a bigger plan. Like, there's a bigger, there's bigger stuff at play here. It's bigger than coins. It's bigger than, we got frog spirit, renewal. It's bigger than materialistic, earthly possessions and values. It's bigger than earthly love. That's why I'm glad like I know I've never been a person to be where I got at like oh my god like oh my god money 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 like I'll do anything for money 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 no that's not me um anybody I've ever been in a relationship with knows that I'm not that person because for me the understanding that I have of it is like your currency is love you know what I'm saying and my kingdom, my palace, my mansion ain't on this earth. Do you know what I mean? So I don't, I'm not like gun ho about like, okay, I got to have this mansion. I got to have this amount of money. I got to have, no. I'm more like my spirit needs this amount of this my soul needs this amount of that. I got to maintain this level of this spiritually. Then everything else will fall in line. Do you know what I'm saying? But I got to focus on the light. Because then this is how you gain your renewal. You know? Frogs could be a synchronicity. It's like spirit wants your head down at this time. No matter what's going on, like focus on you. Focus on your on your passions. I'm hearing integrity. Focus on you. Your desires. Yeah. Fire spirit. I, you feel me? I'm gonna have to drop that song. I'm gonna have to drop that song. I'm gonna drop it in the description box. Yeah, I'll check out that song in the description box. Just because this came out. Fire, spirit, energy. You know what I'm saying? Focus on your light within you. That's where your power is. Focus on the Holy Spirit. Connecting to the light. You see how rooted? That's what I'm saying, man. You feel me? This is how we showing up out here. This is how we got to be. You see? This woman's body is the tree. 
can't. This is when I say when your roots run deep, this how you got to be, baby. When the winds blow, she ain't blowing nowhere. She ain't going nowhere. And that's what I'm saying. It's like spirit has you in position where the winds is blowing. But you ain't going nowhere. <laughs> you ain't going nowhere. Because you're in this. Look where you are. Refuge. Look where you are. Retreat. Look at this bubble you're in. There's a bubble of protection. The snow is falling. You know what I'm saying? It's protection, though. Spirit guardian of winter. I'm trying to tell you. This beautiful energy. This is beautiful. Enchanted farm. Grotto. Refuge. You're in hibernation, boo. You in it's okay. These readings coming out slow right now. I almost felt bad for a minute. I ain't gonna lie, I did. I was like, damn, you know what I'm saying? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Spirit need these airways anyway. I'm about to get off the I'm about to get off the line. Y'all, I'll holler at y'all tomorrow. You know what I mean? It's like it's bigger, it's bigger stuff going on. We sometimes can be in the motherfucking way, okay? But yeah, spirit is like, mm hmm, focusing on your light. This is where your power is. Know that you are protected, okay? Rest. It's okay to get rest at this time. The downtime, it's okay. Some of us, you know what I'm saying, ladies, we on our bed. You know what I'm saying? We, on, we tired, okay? It's time to just surrender, okay? It's time to release. Okay, this is the time of release. <laughs> Not to gross y'all out, man. But, you know, I'm just saying. It's like that type of energy. It's okay to, to be in slow motion. It's okay to slow down. Because in the slowing down, whew, spirit will have you focused on something else, bro. Look at this. Look at this. In these. Look how I'm talking about focusing on the light. Look at the light focus. I know I made that word up. But you know what I'm saying? In this picture right here, she's focused on the light. Okay? This is your inner light. This is your own essence. Right? Yourself. Self-care is the best. I'm telling you, self-care is the best love. Alright? Self-love is the best love. Alright? This picture right here, she's focused on the light. Again, right? Let me call out these angel numbers. 16, 9, 11, and 20. Right here, she's focused on the light. Okay? All right? Somebody, some of y'all, y'all, we about to meet our prince. Okay? The frog, how they, you kiss the frog and it turns into a prince? Some of us, we about to, these frogs about to turn into some princes. So we need to be making sure we the princesses <laughs> out here in these streets. It's time to retreat, okay? So that we can mm -hmm, recharge, okay? Gain your protection, gain your strength, all right? Gain your power, okay? It's time to like recharge. Focus on the light, stay in the light. But something definitely went down that has now, it's not hidden anymore. All this light out here that I'm talking about, yeah, it's been illuminated, definitely. Um, yeah, it has something to do with our energy, the energy of our ancestors. Y'all know this already? Y'all already know. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. But notice too, though, we got this dragon out here with this power, okay? And this dragon is watching over this woman who's resting, okay? The light is right above her. Okay. So it's okay. It's being taken, it's being handled. While we're resting in the downtime, spirit is already. Look at that. While we're resting, let me show you your ancestor. You see your ancestors hiding back here? You see this light, this treasure? You're the treasure. Your ancestors, while you're resting, are shining their light upon you. Okay? It's okay to rest. It's okay. Grace. Right? Because why? We got miracles coming in. Okay? So this right now, yeah, you may feel uncertainty. 
okay about this new path because this is somewhere we haven't ever been before this is where we're about to go okay but see what you got to know is you have the wisdom that's required for this expansion okay as we're expanding across this new territory jupiter energy heavy jupiter energy okay gemini energy with the wisdom the expansion is jupiter sagittarius pisces so spiritually your gifts your wisdom is expanding and sometimes it's like okay you got to go within you got to rest you have to find refuge right because that's when we receive our downloads i just get this energy y'all this around right now i just feel like we're just receiving a bunch of downloads right now yeah moonlight enchanted magic we're receiving a bunch of downloads while we're in sanctuary meaning virgo energy while we're within right during this mercury retrograde but it's like when this moon and this retrograde pass mainly the confirmation mainly the energy of this moon and this first week of retrograde i feel we're going to feel a lifting right and it's going to have us refocus our strength and our focus is going to be strong okay but it's like right now spirit is saying rest yes so that i can transcend i can shower down i can i can i can envelop you I can down I can put these downloads into your mind, okay, with the transcending Pegasus energy, this enlightenment. I can come down while you're resting and I can fill your mind up with all these downloads. Well see when we receive all these type of downloads and stuff like that, y'all, you know our bodies have to adjust. Okay? Look at this. Purification. Our bodies have to adjust. We have to let go of what no longer serves the old um, thought process, okay? The old way of thinking. Because this upgrade that we're receiving this go around at this time, y'all, this is like, I'm hearing next level. Okay? This is an upgrade, upgrade. Like, this is ascension. Like, you know how you, we know we've been on this journey. We know we've been, we've been um, fighting this battle and we know that we've been, um, conquering right having the spiritual warfare and things like that and i spoke about spirit clearing the battlefield but it's like okay the clearing of the battlefield is occurring right well it's like once the battlefield is clear you know it's like everybody got to get word okay who won you know what i mean like yeah they won woo, 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 west side you know whatever how you side have y'all want it whatever okay north side whatever south side whatever side okay like okay whoever won it's like all that has to be um delegated has to be made clear okay you know it take time to travel to get to these lands to let them know like hey this land was conquered by wooty Woopa. however you guys you know what i'm saying but it's like that type of energy like spirits letting it know letting them know so it's like everybody's receiving their papers you're receiving your orders also that's the other thing it's the energy of receiving your orders for this next phase this next assignment this next journey this next chapter this next um um this next journey okay so with purification spirit is like yeah see what needs to go okay purify your space go within rest okay because after this phase when everything is clear the battlefield is clear it's time for you to go on and um step into your position here stag spirit leadership it's time for you to be about that action it's time for you to put in that work so basically enjoy this downtime yep this freedom <laughs> enjoy the beauty of it whoops sorry guys yeah enjoy the beauty of this freedom for now because once this energy shifts and everybody gets their papers and everything is made clear and the communication is had and the illumination comes out and all that good stuff in this ship y'all don't don't get caught with your drawers down you know what i mean don't get left in the bathroom you know what i'm saying because we we going after this happiness here okay this passage done opened up for us okay so Make sure you, you take care of all your business so that when we all aboard, you know what I'm saying? And you, you on the ship, you on the boat, you on the train, you on the plane, you on there. Do you know what I mean? So right now, it's winter time. Go in. Get in your bare energy. And get your healing on. It's okay to rest. Refuge. Okay? Refuge. And while you're in refuge, while you're resting, while you're healing, focus on your light. Focus on your inner healing. Focus on yourself, self-care, your self-love, your self-worth, 
Get your protection up. Do your studying. Focus on your knowledge. Gain as much knowledge as you can during this time, okay? As we go through this transformation, I'm telling you, because then when you come out of it, look at this. With maple spirit, the generosity of spirit will be abundant, okay? And this is how you come out. You see her? She got her wings, okay? The pressure, uh, uh, she, a pearl, okay? What is this? This is a pearl, pearl of wisdom. So you have your pearls of wisdom. You know what I'm saying? So usually, I feel like just use your time wisely during this downtime, during this time of uncertainty, this time where we're not sure what's going on or what, 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 and what, what, and this, that, and the other. Be not wrapped up in that and those details, okay? with patience don't fog spirit don't get wrapped up in the fog okay don't get caught up in the fog okay you focus on the light okay period new beginnings all right daffodil spirit i hope you guys have enjoyed this reading if you have be sure to like share comment and subscribe and you guys be sure to give thanks gratitude be sure to continue to remain playful right as we go throughout this um journey of growth okay of change all right of chaos spirit is like yeah it's needed but at the end is stability okay so hang on in there you guys my nose is itching y'all hang on in there um i love each and every one of you guys bye